let us continue with our lesson and what we will do first is i think i need to make it a little bit a zoom in to i think at least 150 i think that will be more better for you guys to watch because i think 100 is too small i think for you guys to watch so i think we will also not use currently this one so i think let me uh, drag to the left and let me make it a little bit bigger so it may be more easy for you guys to watch and i'm sorry for in the previous lecture i have already made it 100 so i think that may be a bit uh, not clear for you guys to watch so today we will learn about the another option or another there is a building function for us which is the first only so let's make use of a first only so f i r s t only so if you type a first only then you can see over here we have a first only which will uh, basically select the only first record from the current uh, whatever you have selected it will only select the first record so it will return only the first selected record and first only one uh, will also is a similar one it will only record the same first record and first only 10 will uh, re um, will return at least a 10 record for us and first only 100 will return a 100 record a first 100 record for us and first only 1000 will return a uh, 1000 first only 1000 record for us so if we use a first only then if we use a while select first only from cost table then where cost table that sells district id is equals to equals to 10 so which will basically will return a 10 a 10 record for us but if we use a first only option uh, let us see how many record we are going to use so we are at least uh, we are still in a while loop so while loop will at least go through all of the record and should print out and just run this and we are getting only one so it will only select the first record but the filter over here is a 10 but what we have done over here is that we have make use of a first only so the first only will return the first only record so it similarly is the first only one so if we just run it and you should get only the one record if you clear it out and again run you should get only the one record from it so the first record and also we have our first record of 10 so if you use a 10 then we will get a 10 record so we are getting a 10 record so that's a similar if you type 100 then you will get 100 record so this is to only select you you can use this to fetch record or faster because you may not want to retrieve the whole record but you may just want to retrieve first first 10 or you may just want to retrieve first 100 record so at the time we can make use of a first only so sometimes there may be a two record with a, a when when we use a where, where statement so similarly here we have a 10 record but we only want to get a only one record so we just use a first only so it will give, give, give us the first record so that's uh, make that's where we can make use of a first only uh, built-in function in our uh, sql query in x plus plus so i hope you guys have some understanding over here and if you still have some question over here uh, you can let me know and you can also go through the microsoft documentation site they have there they have mentioned it clearly that how to use make use of a first only so i will see you in the next video till then have a great day